This is the story of the tall striker. Now let's just cut to the chase. This guy's game plan is run to the box if he can even manage with those stiff joints. Plant himself there and camp it out for the rest of the game and get his head on absolutely everything. He's slow. His lankiness is absolutely off the scale. He cannot run to save his life. He has the stiffest turn you'll ever see. But his strength is god tier. His center of gravity is in the sky. So even if you want to push him off the ball, you can't. It's like trying to push a fence. Now the interesting part is that tall strikers, they come in two forms. Either they're a totally useless second choice striker who bench warms for 90% of their footballing career and is only there to come on when the coach feels he's been left with no choice but to bring on someone tall to stand at the top of the pitch because they're losing and have resorted to lumping it up the pitch in the hope that somebody gets a dusty header on it. Stereotypically, this guy's technical ability has him getting tangled on the shoelaces of his laceless boots. Or the tall striker who's also lanky, got the stiffest run you've ever seen and no technique, but he's confident and knows how to play to his strength and so he's a beast in the final third.